Hey everybody, we are back in the kitchen for a cooking video. It's been a while. This is a very simple cooking video. But anyway, it is Sunday, October 9th, 2022 at 4 17 p.m. And we are here today making a bacon double cheeseburger. Um, I made some the other day. I've been craving comfort food because I'm under a lot of stress lately. Comfort food is, you know what I mean? I'm coming off drugs and I've got stress, life stress. So two, those two things equal my waistline getting a little bit bigger and enjoying getting there. Um, so let me just show you what we've got here uh, to prepare the station basically to make the burger. Um, as you would expect, right here we have our, our fixings. We have a chopped onion, our bun, relish, ketchup, mustard, a knife I don't really need anymore since I chopped up the onion. Okay. And it's going to go right over here. And then over here, we've got our, uh, I only have two strips of bacon left. So here they are. Uncured bacon. I like uncured bacon. And we have two patties, quarter pound patties. All right. And also our uh, American cheese sliced American cheese. All right. So we're just waiting for this to get hot and then we'll go. I, you know, I try not to eat too much red meat, but I enjoy fucking, uh, you know, a burger now and then I'm an American, right? So, but I, you know, what's really weird is I've gotten so used to eating. Uh, well, for a long time, you know, I got used to eating like boneless, skinless chicken breast and a lot of fruits and vegetables, which I, I still try to get as much in as I can. Uh, but lately, since I learned how to, how to roast a chicken, a whole chicken, I've been into that. I've been digging that quite a bit and I've been doing that. It actually made my uh, LDL cholesterol go up, but also my HDL cholesterol go up just a little bit. The HDL is the healthy cholesterol. It's the way to remember it, the H. Um, the HDL went up a couple of points, not too much, but the LDL went up a little bit more. Not like a ton. It's still within the range of good. Um, I've got to go and get my blood checked. Uh, I got to actually look at my, I got to look, because it hasn't been six months yet, but it will be six months very soon. Or maybe it's just been over six months, but I'll let you know. I'll let you know my Facebook page. Facebook.com forward slash JTCSF. All right, so um, let's go ahead and put start these guys. All right. I'm going to time these for uh, four minutes. Maybe four minutes a side for eight minutes. I started out doing five minutes per side, a little bit more than I want to cook, so we drop it a little bit. All right, first time I did it. Um, let's wait till this gets smoking. We'll turn the fan on. It'll give us a little bit of little, little bit of a reprieve from the noise of the fan. Um, for those of you that haven't seen, I think most of you that have seen my Facebook page already know. Is that gonna give us a little bit more light? That does. Let's do that. Okay. Um, this is my Octubre cake I made last night with candy corn, chocolate frosting, chocolate cake, Octubre, and it's delicious. And that's, that's all me so far. I've got, you know, it, it is so good. It's a devil's food cake. So let me get a spatula. Tarachula? Not tarachula, you know what I mean. All right. So I use Pam. You can use oil or butter or whatever you want, but I use Pam for things like this where I, you know, but I usually, when I saute vegetables, I usually use uh, veg a vegetable oil. 
right now I've got Wesson. That's what I usually buy. I usually buy Wesson. I put this cheese away. I'm also going to take out some, uh, believe it or not, I know it's not a good pear, but we want to eat fruit and we don't want this to go bad. I have some blueberries I bought the other day. I'm going to put these in a um, little container here or a little, uh, you know, bowl that you would usually put like chips and salsa in and whatever. And I'm gonna rinse these off and I'm gonna have these with my, uh, with my lunch. more because I worry about not going through them in time and I want to make sure that I do. So what we got here. Um, all right. Blueberries and a cheeseburger, right? <laughs> kind of unusual, but we get it in when we can. All right, so we have nine seconds to go on the burger. Two seconds, one second. Bam! Flip it, bitch. All right. Flip the bacon. Flip the bacon, bitch. All right. I'm sorry, I'm a little bit drunk, so I'm just having fun, you know? Like, not that I don't do that sober, though, too, I do. But <laughs> probably be a little bit more, like on video, a little bit more, like, you know, connected to something, I guess. But anyway. All right, so we're going to go ahead and put the, I'm going to time it to four minutes again and then put the cheese on right now. Well, bam. Well, bam. All right. We actually don't, well, I'll put it on a little bit. All right, there we are. Okay, I'm gonna wash a dish right here real quick just to use again uh, to put a piece of chocolate cake on for dinner or for, for dessert rather after my lunch. I just had a piece of cake, chocolate cake, but honestly, you know why I'm doing it? Because I just wanna show you, uh, I wanna make it pretty for the, for the tray that I'm gonna show you at the end. That's why I'm doing it. I don't really want a piece of chocolate cake, but it's not a big piece of chocolate cake, so it doesn't really matter. You know what I mean? Sometimes you gotta do the look. Sometimes, you know? But just don't try to make the look a substance. That's the difference. Here's 
Here's our clean plate. The Coulter Bart video that I did like almost two years ago was in the same shirt, except the iPad was right here in the kitchen. I will post it on my Facebook page. I think I already, I did recently. I might do it again, because I'm pretty sure I was in the same shirt. I ripped this humongous, I mean like right in the middle of cooking, right there, just like I do. I'm known to do that kind of thing. Well, I took out Jello. I was gonna have Jello, but I don't think so now. I don't think I'm gonna have Jello. Jello I made the other day, green jello, lime jello, Peter lemon jello. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright, that's our bell. The alarm, rather, for the. for everything. Letting us know that it's off. Um. Strip of bacon. Another strip of bacon. Number two. Now we put on a little bit of relish. Come on, relish. There you go. That's good. All right, and then a little bit of uh, mustard. By the way, for anyone that doesn't have any idea, medium for the burgers, okay? Wait till it gets hot enough and then you put the burgers in. All right, and so we have the condiments on there and now we're gonna put the onions. I don't have any other, uh, I don't have any uh, lettuce or anything, okay? Come over here and take a look. Oh, my fucking cord's going in the water. There we go. What do you think about that? Huh? You want that? Huh? Get you horny? All right. No, probably not horny, but food horny. All right. Hold on. All right. So I'm going to put this right here. Top it with that. Look at that. Food porn, honey. Food porn. All right. Now watch this. Ooh, 
We have a glass of milk. I may have a second burger that I'm not going to make on, on camera. I don't know. We'll see. lunch dinner I don't know you know what I mean I may if I make dinner again it'd probably be like 10 o'clock at night I'll probably be reheated uh, tuna casserole which I made last night it was very very good um, so here's my meal take a look pretty good huh All right, everybody, I'm gonna remind you as I always do at the end of every video, to remember to brush your teeth, to floss, which I didn't brush my teeth today yet. I will, I promise. I, I don't prompt, no. I'm gonna let my yes be yes and my no be no. I'm gonna brush my teeth today. Remember to brush your teeth, to floss, and to say your prayers, but I'll see you in the next video, which will be maybe at six if I decide to do a video today, or I'll post the log to Facebook. I love you all, and peace.